to the Miami Heat Zone Podcast. I'm your host, Martel Llewellyn. Guys, if you are a Miami Heat fan, continue to like, share, comment, subscribe. Thank you for all the support. Guys, we're pushing to 4,000 subscribers. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And thank you for all the support. So look at Bam Adebayo, man. He's really recruiting for the Miami Heat. Now, I'm not saying that Bam is going to get all these players just within the next two years. But think about it. Look at Bam Adebayo and the whole arena. The whole arena. He's sitting next to Giannis and Tatakumpo. And you would think that they would have a huge rivalry because of all the battles that we've had. Now, look at Bam Adebayo right here in the middle with Donovan Mitchell. We all know that he has a great relationship with Donovan Mitchell. And Donovan Mitchell is supposed to be on the Miami Heat. Same thing with Jason Tatum. Look at Bam Adebayo. He was picking up Jason Tatum's kid. When you're picking up people's kids, you know you have a really good relationship. And just the other day, Bam was kind of criticized for, you know, dapping up Tatum right after the game. And we all know that they grew up together, play basketball together, and they have a good relationship. So what does this all mean? Just look at Dwayne Wade. A lot of people that have just come to the Miami Heat, Victor Oladipo, uh, Terry Rozier, and the list goes on. A bunch of people are all connected to Dwayne Wade, and that's the reason why they either want to go to the Miami Heat or they eventually will end up on the Miami Heat. And same thing with Bam Adebayo. So I'm not saying that these guys are going to be here within the next two years, but think about it. The Jimmy Butler window is soon coming to an end. He's going to retire eventually. And when you think about who are they going to pair Bam and Abayo with if Tyler Hero stays, these are all the young stars that are across the NBA that also love the Miami Heat, but they also love Bam and Abayo. Bam and Abayo, he's one of the top 10 guys that everybody wants to play with. Everybody wants to play with Bam. You know, he's built great, great relationships throughout the NBA. And I think that's very important because just like how Dwayne Wade got Chris Bosh and LeBron James here, Obviously, now going into the future, we're hoping that not only can D-Wade help recruit, but Bam and Abao can help recruit other players to join the Miami Heat. But let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 3,000 subscribers.